Warning, this video may contain spoilers, speculation, and fake horror card scans. However, I will try my best to bring you all the right information and information that is not fake. However, there always will be some speculation in these videos, so keep that in mind. Yo, what is good fellow teenies, my name is Fellow Teeny, and today I am bringing the road to Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. A hundred days remaining. Before we jump into today's episode, let's try and get a hundred likes for that support. Please and thank you. That really means a lot to me. Anyway, today's episode is going to be very, very short. Um, only reason why I'm doing this is because this is actually really, really uncalled for. And, well, this series is for Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. All the news for Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. Even though I missed a trailer. But I, I, I kind of knew there was going to be a trailer, so... Yeah, only a really new thing they showed that trailer was the uh, Pokeblox is reintroduced. So, yeah. Kind of something we kind of knew was going to be there because, well, it's a remake. Why would Pokeblox not be in it? So, yeah. But today's video is actually... Yeah, so... They, let's, the, the Korean Pokemon website kind of screwed up really bad. But for us, it's, it's a good screw up. For them, someone might lose their job today. So around five, six hours ago, I think it's pretty, I'm pretty sure it's five hours ago. Omega Slow, no, Mega Slowbro and Mega Adino was, well, was not revealed. It was leaked. By accident, some pe person that, wor that works for the Korean Pokemon company and does the website maintenance and all that good stuff, uh, accidentally leaked Omega, what the fuck? Mega Slowbro and Mega... Uh, Dino. So, that, this is how they look. It, slow bro, I, I'm kinda upset with his design. Honestly, his design, it, it is him in a giant ass shell. It looks like the shell evolved as well, but that means slow bro is gonna be more defensive than it is. At least that's what I think. Like, slow bro's already a defensive beast, but with the shell being there, I can see him being a lot more defensive and, um, yeah, he's gonna be bulky as fuck then, if if that's true. However, we don't really know much about Mega Slowbro other than it was leaked and how it looks, and we've got like two gameplay images of it in game. So, yeah. So for right now, we don't really know anything about Sl Mega Slowbro. As I said before, we don't know its moves, we don't know its stats. All that we know is this is Mega Slowbro. And so now it's time for Mega Ardino. Now, Mega Ardino kind of looks like something from a Disney movie. No offense, Pokemon. Honestly, it looks like something from, um... Forgot that movie of the talking teacups and shit. Uh, but anyway, it looks like something from there. Um, I don't know why. Or it looks like, f um... That movie of the talking rabbit. Forgot. I, I don't know. I don't watch much Disney movies anymore. I don't watch movies, period, that much anymore. Um, anyway, it looks like something from a Disney movie. But hey, that's, not, that's not a bad thing. I honestly like Ardino's new design way better. Then it's this Ardino. Mega Ardino looks sick as hell. It's got a little like fluffy thing by its chin. Who is a soft Ardino? And its ears. Its ears look amazing. Like honestly. Now this. It, it kind of reminds me of Slurpuff. In a way. But not really. Only reason why it reminds me of Slurpuff. Is because the coloring is almost the exact same. Except Slurpuff is pink. And it looks like cotton candy. Where Ardino looks sick. And so it looks like a Disney movie character. Now, now I'm just gonna go into speculation here. Uh, with its little ears, with the thing that down its ears, it can I, I, it remind. I, it looks like it's gonna be a fairy type Pokemon for me. That's just my opinion. Um, it, it looks like it's gonna be a fairy type Pokemon. Honestly, uh, it might become normal fairy type. If that's the case, I wouldn't mind it at all. Cause uh, do you know, it's bulky, but it just being a normal type, it has. Yeah, it's pretty weak against fighting types. So if, he, if it becomes fairy normal or normal fairy, whatever the first order goes, um, it's gonna be pretty good. It's gonna be really, it's gonna be better than it was before. And yeah, I, I can't really see it being more defensive or anything, um, because well, it doesn't really have anything to protect it. I think it act, its attack might increase. If so, I don't know. It, it just looks like attack must it might, the attack might increase. So, yeah, that's all for today, actually. I'm sorry about the short episode, and, uh, yeah, 
So, hope you guys in this video. Please remember to leave a like and comment. Maybe subscribe if you haven't already. Until next time, peace out. See you guys then. And as always, thank you for watching.